Okay, excellent connection. Right, I think today I'm gonna do. Actually, I've already started. I'm gonna do some box missions, but doing the 45,000 K box mission, 45 K box mission. I'll listen to a little Space Tomato while I do it, and I'm going to share that mission between two accounts. I'm just waiting on that to pop up. I am. I am. One second. Somebody else doing that mission? Oh, great. All right, tomato, I'm gonna to start you. I'm probably gonna have a little bit of problems down here. I've never had anybody else be down here, but we'll see. Okay, right, tomato, take it away. finished my 2018 New Year's resolution, people are still crazy outside, and Star Citizen is still in development. Some things are eternal, but that doesn't mean they aren't enjoyable. This is an overview of what Star Citizen can offer you right now, and it will tell you whether it's worth jumping in now or waiting another 10 years. As usual, you'll be treated to this base tomato special, with plenty of eye candy to keep you entertained. I hope you enjoy the show and get something out of it. Thank you for coming to my tomato talk. Alright, there's like no one on this server and there's two people down here. started out as a good looking MMO, it has blossomed into one of the most detailed and expansive first person games out there. Well, I have to do it or I lose reputation with Redline or Redbox or whoever the hell it is. I forget. It's a pretty fun game to play with others. Yes, I waited too long to do this mission. that point is that the community is a pretty good hmm. one generally being helpful all around and sharing a hope for a great space game the average age in star citizen is a little bit higher than other games that being said servers are currently limited to 50 players which is a paltry amount for an MMO. while the studio is currently providing regular updates on the tools that will help sidestep this limit the silence in game is noticeable Before we formally begin, the amount of bespoke and unique items in the game at this stage is astonishing. There are well over 50 completely unique ship types for you to fly, destroy, explore, and just stare at. And if we're talking about variations, then there are over 100 ships. It's incredible. The the heck? Subtle differences Oops, I gotta move my other account so I don't different companies. Between the paint Get knocked schemes, off the server. Schemes, or even door styles. There are little details everywhere. Restricted area for this character. Before them. These characteristics also roll over to things like weapons. All ship and FPS weapons are made by companies with very specific... What the heck? Why is a restricted area for my other account, but not this one? ...developments as well. And every weapon in almost every ship can be purchased with in-game credits. Of play and earnings and earnings. Guess I could try to change necessary characters out. Game for the original 
all of these items of course come with many probably should just take the rep hit and go do another and mission balance. but and star citizen has no shortage of those one on the nose more forward there okay all right come down We have the general points out of the way. Let's dive in and see what the details offer us. Oh. There's tracking on this character. There are plenty of locations in Star Citizen for you to visit. The scale of this the game character doesn't even have the mission. Not elite, dangerous, large, but large. Well, I still and have the mission on the main character. Much more detailed. This yeah, because I have the marker. I thought I shared this mission. Is mind blowing. You'll be flying dozens of millions of kilometers just to meet up with a friend, only to then walk 100 meters to the train station, which flies five more kilometers into the city. The difference in interactivity and scale in this game is almost unmatched when combined with detail of the environments. And the possibility of two hey. entirely new star systems Must not be is tracked. just around the corner. Even as the game grows every quarter, the environments grow more and more diverse. And keep in mind, these locations I'm showing you are all due for updates, expansions, and improvements that have been discussed over the years, but will be on hold until the game has reached a more mature state. Now let's take a look at each of the distinct characters. Oh well, I'm done. Arthur is a planet covered by a city. Think Coruscant from Star Wars. It is layered in industrial, commercial, and residential. Now it just hurts the. And quite uh, remains the most industrialized hurt planet human space despite its short rest of the both counts While now that's bonk much scale as might be imagined and not a single source of water or wilderness the land is due to receive extra work in the future the primary landing zone well be 18 a small metropolis with a trading area hospital mission river and multiple ships selling weapons clothes and armor our also has two moons both of which offer a variety i guess of i can locations to haul cargo to and from and pirates I'm tempted to just to log off combat. and back on be at Everest and start again probably quicker do it like that but Hurston is the dirtiest planet you'll find having been used atrociously for many weapons tests and mining operations over the decades it has several biomes for you to explore before entering its major city of Lorville a rather Blade Runner styled city towered over by the large Hurston headquarters building this city offers sales locations for armor, clothes, and ship weapons, as well as useful items such as the multi-tool. With four moons in orbit, Hurston offers an incredible amount of diverse gameplay, with some of the best mining areas in the game, derelict ships, outposts to sell and buy at, and numerous bounties and pirates to chase. Got a torque imbalance? Wow, that tune's blacking out. Now, this might envision Apple developing its first home away from Earth. Despite a disastrous terraforming incident early in the planet's settled history, the company, Microtech, went on to make it a very livable and inviting place. Whoa! While most of the planet is freezing cold snowy forests, you'll also find obsidian fields and alpine forests in green zones as well. This planet is great for exploration and holds some of the most beautiful landscapes in the game. With three moons, there are also a multitude of gameplay opportunities in the area. Sign landing bay. Time to land. The 
the final planet in the first star system, Crusader, has been around longer than any other planet. This is because it has only I been suppose I should for the last get rid of the mission and take the and hit and hopefully I get a new one. Explorable. Due to enter the game in 2021, this planet is a massive gas giant with space wheels flying throughout the clouds and a cloud city floating in the mid-atmospheric level. That's right, the landing zone on this planet is floating amongst the clouds and is actually used as a manufacturing area for the large ships Crusader Industries creates, allowing for lower construction landing and fuel costs. Deployed. Pretty smart. This planet has three moons as well and tons of space stations, hidden outposts, mining areas, and in-game events to attend in the area. Now, you may have noticed these plants all have weird names. That is because in lore, the Landing government complete. sold these planets to companies in order to raise some money from the discovery of the system. So the companies came up with the most creative names their marketing departments could muster. This also goes in line with what I was saying earlier with the companies existing in the game. Crusader Industries makes ships that are beloved by the I fans. hate to lose rap for also dropping a mission, but what am I going to do? Missions, locations, and its own landing zone. Little tidbit for you. Let's see how much I lose. I don't have much on this account as far as rep for Red Line or Red Wind. Uh, halfway between that. Why did I give you numbers? Planetary Little bars with no indicators. Interest all throughout every star system in the game. In this system, Stanton, you'll find many space stations dotted throughout the cargo lanes of the system, with cargo decks that don't really do anything. Well, you don't even get a like, are you atmosphere. sure? It's just like, boom. But also with refining decks, which will allow you to turn ore into Yeah, you definitely lost a lot of rep. That's These hurts. stations also act as meeting spots, refueling Ugh. and rearming locations, food and drink stops, sales locations, and areas to spawn additional spaceships. They are surrounded by incredible gas cloud nebulae, which I'll are created lose. by a unique tool that the company has constructed for better visuals in space. As a starter, you'll have to use these space stations right to Right up the middle, lot. runner. But as the game progresses, everybody tends to have more and more reasons to drop by. And then eh. finally, there's Delamar, a planetoid with its own landing zone. I gotta wait for the next 45k when it pop up. Explore. Though Delamar will be moving to its original system in the next couple of years. However, it's definitely worth visiting before being removed, as it's one of the only areas. I should a jump in the car right now. That's see, what I should do. Each of these locations has its own law system and jurisdiction. While Make I'm sure waiting, that's what that's what I'll do. I'll get in the car. Right. Might be in a location where killing somebody is completely allowed. Unless there's a mission like right ready to go, I'm getting the car. Right. Time. Based on the severity oh, of the is. committed, security can hunt you down. First and point, you will be sent to a prison. Welcome security on depot, one of person moves, one. Be required to wait for your sentence to end. All right, let's go time. there now. Okay, I won't get the car. We'll get the car next time. If you're not in that much trouble, though, oh, let's share it. There are ways to avoid jail time, but I'll let you find those on your own. We should file a claim. Just oh, it's made you get so many commercials now. Star Citizen has a decent amount of missions and activities for you to take part in at all times, but generally lacks in mission diversity. Oh, well. This is a shortcoming of the still early alpha status the game holds. There simply aren't that many unique game loops for you to enjoy. That being said, your contract manager hosts many general missions with various methods of achievement. I wonder if it's rules. because I took so long. Or any money making activities in the game as a group is also easy due to the money trading app, which allows you to split your earnings. So you can still enjoy the game and share all your money with your friends. you can run let's start with combat you can assault various underground bunkers taking an approach from the air fighting off turrets or a stealthy approach from the ground once you're inside you'll clear out hostiles and either destroy or steal any contraband inside if there is any some missions also call for you to assault these bases to find a specific data blade you can commit to a boarding party assault on a commandeered luxury cruise ship 
You'll need to destroy patrol ships and enter with your team to kill pirates while saving the security team and stopping a data hacking transfer. Bounty hunting is an option for those who would like to pursue the career. While you can't turn in live bounties, it is possible to hunt down and destroy both NPC and player bounties with various rewards depending on their crimes and various difficulties depending on how much health they might have. There are also plenty of general ship combat missions for various sized groups. Claim jumper missions will have you clearing out miners who stole somebody else's mining claim, along with their armed escort. Data retrieval missions will have you blowing up protected probes, which are trying to commit. I think my mission had expired. Take you on a route with an NPC. And somebody else had got it, maybe. All of these missions can pay out pretty well. I know I shared it to the second account, and that account didn't have it. But it didn't have it in. I didn't if look in the history, but oh well. Action. There are various investigation missions. Oh, that kind of popped right out. Find lost souls in caves, lost cargo and shipwrecks, or the black box of a mysteriously destroyed ship. Service beacons provide quick on-the-spot jobs such as personal transport and combat assistance. Mining is arguably the best and most interesting way of making money. It is the most fleshed out career path and actually offers unique experiences in three different formats. Ship mining is available in two ships with a brand new interface, allowing you to mine minerals from a multitude of materials which can be sold raw for often hundreds of thousands of credits. Or refined That's what I should be doing mining for a higher profit. Vehicular mining is available in one ground vehicle, which can roll over the ground in search of smaller rocks, which can be cracked for a multitude of valuable resources. This can often be the most lucrative way of making money in the game if you can find the right moon to mine and the right place to sell. Hand mining requires your multi-tool and generally takes place deep in caves where small deposits of minerals can be found. Ooh, I don't think I brought... Stuff in your oh yeah, I did, I did, I did, I did. Keep in mind, very shortly, new types of caves will be added, including sinkhole, fissure, and vehicle explorable caves. This means that mining could change drastically once these caves are introduced. All of the previously mentioned methods of mining offer various levels of gameplay that are up to you to discover through creativity. You can get groups together with dedicated roles for mining, transport, and scanning for new materials, maintaining a constant feed of revenue which can then be divvied out to all members using the finance app. Check out my own community's attempt at making this happen in the corner or in the video description. You may have noticed earlier I mentioned refining as an option for some gameplay as well. Refinery Space Station modules are brand new addition to the game as of the end of 2020. They allow players to input raw ore to be refined into more valuable materials which can then be transported to sales stations for profit. The refining process is actually fairly complex and requires some knowledge of the game and the way things work in order to get the most out of it. It also allows cargo haulers to have some fun and get involved in the mining game loop. It's one of those things that's easy to do and for most people completely ignorable, but if you want to get the most out of it, you can make it hard for yourself. And this is the first iteration added in December Nothing. 2020. In the future, we'll I like when the first one's mine. Process, as well as the refining game loop brought to ships. There so we go. Say, we'll get the first one, get the shooting starting. The game. Started. Then there are the cargo haulers. You know the type. Basically the Euro Truck Simulator crowd. That Euro Truck cool Simulator crowd. This is another great and expansive way to spend your time playing and making money. While the dynamic economy of Star Citizen is not fully be operational, vague. supply and demand, changing prices, and differing material I gotta turn the music up. That's what's usually not on. Materials, as well as the I forgot. The After the patch, the things change. Uh, I got to... It is possible to buy out all of That's the stock of the item in one normally. place. To find a station that has too much of said item and can't buy, or for valuable trading routes to shift in between every quarter. Cargo hauling can be done to an extent with almost any ship in the game. Though there are ships at every size that, that one are best stayed in their class down. for this profession. For those looking to upgrade from their starter ship, the Nomad is a great option. And I'm always giving away some over on my Twitch channel every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So if you'd like the chance to grab one, let me send you cargo haul. The heck was Just that? remember not to put all of your money into one haul, because if you lose it, you lose everything.
There's also a more official method of hauling cargo that ties directly into the contract manager system, but it's not very useful for making money. It will take you to various places though and help you learn how the system is laid out. Again, these can be Ooh, accessed via we go. contract manager. Um, I'll get that later. And of course, there are more illegal activities you can get into. Like even attacking a, space a box station right there. Can draw out major threats to battle. These aren't usually but here, beware, are they? The guns defending these stations are huge. Like the size of a spaceship huge. So good luck. In addition to these more general missions and activities you take on that we've been discussing, you nope. also have access to several mission givers throughout the star system. Consider these to be like fixers in Cyberpunk 2077. These individuals will give you more developed, engaging missions around the verse that you can take on by yourself or with others. And you can only get missions from many of them by earning a reputation that catches their eye. Reputation is incredibly important in Star Citizen and acts as the second currency after UEC. If you'd like to learn more about the reputation system and what's planned for it in the future, you can check out the video in the top corner or in the video description. Sometimes these mission givers will have stories associated with their missions, and sometimes you will even encounter a player that has been sent on a mission to oppose you. One particular mission line that has recently been expanded is the Arlington Bounty Hunter mission series, which has you tracking down a local crime family in a planetary system, nailing them. If they turn up the ambient the sound, I can't hear. And Idris, a massive 240 meter. I don't remember this ambient sound. It's a fun experience with friends, pays quite well, and why. gets you a look at the Idris. If you want a more detailed look at the current biggest ship in the game, you can find it on my channel here in the corner or down below. As the game grows, more of these mission games will be implemented into the game, and the missions will become much more story-driven and interesting, oh, well. as they aren't really all that amazing in their current state. For now, these individuals and their missions can be quite bugged and are mostly avoided. This is due to a problem that affects the entire game currently, an overworked network. And until this is fixed, hopefully sometime in 2021, expect to not see any new mission givers in the game. Yeah. How much for that, I guess. Don't let me get Welcome killed. To the the Disney bundle, oh where my Disney goodness. Plus, Hulu, and ESPN Plus come to life on all your screens. Definitely Hulu, radio. Disney hits and Speaking of problems like bugs and whatnot, let's talk about the pain points of the game. It is in development. Deep in development. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> oh God, please. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> and because of this, code in every part of the game is always changing. This leads to inevitable bugs popping up. And even after those bugs get fixed, the nature of the changing I guess no one's going to shoot at me this time. Back up again. If you aren't ready to experience crashes, bugs, and general annoyances here I should there, just do this and get out. Hold off on the game for now. And you should also consider your PC. This game is thirsty, and the glass is never big enough. This glass you is definitely... <laughs> this, <piece, laughs> this game is thirsty. And an SSD to play this game on. I would also suggest a pretty recent build. And while this may be too much to pay full price for, there are fairly frequent free fly events in which you can test the game out for yourself before spending the $45 to buy it. There are also often discount sales on starter game packages like right now until January 11th. Might as well go get this. Even if you want to wait. Or I guess nobody's right going to shoot this time. The server is really slow. At this Come moment. on. And you can reserve some extra money for whenever you decide to pull the trigger by using my referral code on the screen now or by clicking the link in the video description to start your really I don't need the them I got so many rifles database resets no Before one's dying so I can't get any armor in, sometimes a major fix will be needed in which certain databases may be wiped this has I'm good for let's get the hell out of here off the top of my head but it is always a possibility. Gotten plenty so of free ammo this game and armor accepted as being an option to all is not a 100% guarantee Speaking of major updates, this game features many new features that are constantly being shuffled around and triaged based on importance and other aspects. This can mean features you want and hope for will be delayed by three months or even longer. You can see more about where things look to be headed by following the roadmap for the game on the game website and subscribing to this YouTube channel.
but I warn you, if you decide to follow this game closely, it's best to focus on what we have now and not what's coming next, because there's a chance it won't actually make the cut. Despite how much I enjoy this game, my answer to you is this. As of January 2021, for the average person, this game is a no. If this is the first video you're watching on this game, I highly suggest you go watch some actual gameplay, preferably on my Twitch channel. <laughs> but it's hard to get a true grasp of this game without watching somebody play, and I feel you really need to experience that before making. Why does it sound so? For somebody like me who loves space games, mess with who has the friends to play with, who is comfortable ambient with the sound, I guess. Crashes, this game is great. All right, hopefully this. But it's better for most people to wait, keep an turret eye on doesn't the shoot at me, and jump in when stability and gameplay catch up to features. Don't worry guys, if you're right here with me, I'll let you know when to get in, and I'll personally introduce you to the game. If you want to keep up with the game, or myself, until then, subscribe to this channel and join the Garden Discord server, a place for sci-fi. You can also find me on Twitch and Twitter, where you can interact with me. Uh, I forgot where I'm going. And if you'd like to support me here, become a YouTube channel member or a Patreon member, and get exclusive videos, early videos, and I'll more that also helps support my giveaways, which you can always find in my video descriptions and, of course, over on my Twitch channel as well, where I'm currently giving away nomads. And I am afraid videos. to go I directly to another planet. Where is it? Get in touch. Over a marker. I'll catch you guys all in the next one. Okay, I gotta change the station. Let's see what YouTube's gonna have me watch next. going to pick picking anything ads find some more tomato more tomato please how about some jack axe in it oh here we go wow i had one lined up but of course Atlas. Wait. Oopsie. I had one, but now I can find it. There we go. You stow your things, you hold backspace, and you start over. According to the current schedule, starting in 315, that will be the last option you want to pick. Let's take a look at the two currently scheduled headline features of the next Star Citizen update, and why these are actually game changers. Thank you for coming to my Tomato Talk. And thanks to my newest Patreon members, Mark Steele, Darkchild, Lively, and Ken Garcia. That was that an NPC? Let's start with medical gameplay. There are several major changes coming to the medical system. The most visible change will be the new tools that can be used for healing. The multi tool medical attachment and medical gun will both be joining the med pen and allowing you to heal yourself and others. The closing the in. The multi-tool attachment will add the ability to actually oh, they just scan made for this hard. and determine what is wrong with the patient for more efficient healing. The dedicated tool will allow you to mix certain levels of drugs in order to alleviate some of the symptoms that come with said injuries. 
This brings us to the next major change. Well, so much for doing this in a regular. Injuries. Currently, in-game, your health is determined by each limb and the damage they've taken. You could die just from getting hit in the hand too many times. It was a very static health system, and we know CIG hates static. Instead of this old, simple health pool idea, the team has given every limb its own pool, allowing for variable oh, levels of health and Pisces. as that health is worn away Getting by down in the Pisces. and neglect, it will turn into an injury. <laughs> Injuries are new and pretty bad for you. They cannot be healed by these tools we've discussed, but to understand the significance of the injuries, let's Whoa. talk real quick about death and how Black you package. What the heck? actually won't no. die anymore. Well, you might a little bit, but virtually every non-glitch related deadly situation will end with what you going was into up a with that? That was the drop injuries. off on top this of that. state can allow you to wait it out and see if somebody can come along and heal you up or help you That's get That's not along. cool. And we'll take into account the inventory changes we'll talk about later in this video. The injuries that you could what get if I in was this doing state are cargo. some permanent illnesses that <laughs> can limit myself. your weapon handling, ladder locomotion, regular locomotion, vehicular control, and other physical activities. They one? also probably mess with your vision. These injuries don't come in all sizes either. You'll have three different levels of injuries, three being the lightest and one being the heaviest. While a level three injury may cause issues, a level one injury could stop you from escaping a cave or climbing back into your ship. If you're on your own, you might end up dying simply because you couldn't climb the ramp of your ship. And while I said these injuries are semi-permanent, as you have to find a medical bed to get repaired, they can also be suppressed. As I said before, with the right skills and the correct drugs, you can suppress the debuffs you've received from your injury. As long as you have that medic with you, you will always be able to get back to a bed and heal your character. These first four initial drugs and medication, as well as the debuffs associated with the injuries, all tie into the additional work done to the player status system that now takes into account your blood drug level. And if you'll step aside with me for a bit, I'd like to interject. This is where you see choice and skill once again finding its way into the major aspects of this game. Who you decide to include in your group, how much you pay them, how good they are, and what ship you take are all going to decide if you get out alive when you take on a serious injury. And while this could be some laser healing mechanism, it doesn't really matter to me, because the act of healing a person does not seem to be the focus of this system. It is a system that promotes decision making, preparation, or a good team, because in my opinion, this will change the game just as much for medics as it will for everybody who has to depend on them. Now back to the actual point. This downed state that you'll enter almost every time you take damage is familiar. It's in a lot of games, but many games aren't really this large. And the idea of waiting for somebody to come get you even just 10 minutes later can make you want to just back out and respawn. That's a long but time. Even that will be changing in 3.15. I have Going not forward, successfully you will gotten be able to select a hospital from somewhere throughout the star system that will yet. always bring you back. Even when somebody got there, something went wrong. Sure they couldn't heal me for whatever stupid to, reason. If you will even be able My to body disappeared. On demand. While medical clinics will always be available on space stations, the only actual respawn locations will be landing zones and major areas like Grimhex. A side note, these hospitals will also be able to heal those tier 1 injuries we talked about. And while people won't be dying as much because of the down state, this still poses a problem for those who want to avoid dealing with cities, and puts an emphasis on staying alive. And finally, it's good to know that these locations are good for more than just respawning. If you don't have the necessary equipment for getting your crew back on their feet, Ooh, you can take them nice to one of these locations here. and drop them off for a quick service. You don't always have to have a This medic, character needs no more weapons. Should. This medical system doesn't actually emphasize death all that much yet outside of the respawn system. In the future, the possibility of permanently losing your character and the life insurance costs that come with this game will be huge deterrents to throwing life away carelessly, an important part of what Star Citizen is going for. For now though, that responsibility will rest on the inventory update. Go beyond subscribe. Do Join a channel to help your favorite creator create more. Ooh. Plus, you'll unlock members only stuff like a chance to play together. Who knows? It's up to them and you. Join a channel, give first.
Delivery, delivery. We'll take it. That helps the... The physicalized inventory system is probably it helped. one I of mean, the most important It definitely goes up further than it goes back Star when you Citizen. fail. It goes up more when you if succeed than it goes back when you fail. If every the galaxy had an always accessible global inventory, the entire game would break. Star Citizen would not work. So you can imagine how important it is that CIG gets this right. And why they've All right, actually let me go try been to put very some quiet on about showing us Pisces. any design, functionality, or even concepts at all besides several years ago. Not even a teaser or an Easter so egg. So luckily both my the missiles only hit. Other times they hold back and like I just drilled him with the, like the planet tech review, the ballistics, the quantum system, or squad. I don't 42. think I've ever killed anything so in my Pisces. I'm excited to say the least. I've never been attacked in my Pisces. For this first iteration on the physical inventory system. And I've been building it up, but not really explaining what it is. I'm sorry about that. This system will take away universal access to all of your items and ships across the game localizing your assets to locations and ships and requiring you to consider what and how much of it you are carrying while this is only a step towards the system that will be in the future go land and rearm and wide reaching effects on every single mission that requires you to leave a ship and any profession that requires you to carry something like mercenaries or medics miners or anything else in existence on the ui side this is actually a change that has already been well in the making the personal management app will be removed from the game, and all personal inventory interaction will be conducted in what's called the inner thought system. This is exactly what it sounds like, a consciousness that acts as the lore behind why a bunch of words and oh, items yeah. randomly pop up in the this world one doesn't. around us. Its design and purpose has changed slightly throughout the years, but it will always remain as a way for us to interact with the world. We've seen the early development of this system over the last couple of years, showing a clear intent on the direction but I expect something much more fully featured and polished in 315, with things like drag and drop functionality and the ability to open multiple inventories on one screen. In addition, we will also get the asset manager. Yeah, something we don't really know much I'm so about used to getting armor and everything on these the missions. Tracker of every asset I'm usually able to pick up all this stuff, system, but where they are and where you need to go to transfer equipment this is or retrieve. The, this is the inventory. The system. idea of only really having access to what you're carrying ties pretty obviously into the death mechanics we discussed earlier. If you die outside of a landing zone, you or somebody you know will need to get back to your things before they are looted or they're gone. And while this isn't a big deal during this stage of development, it's just the beginning. Just the beginning. These two changes mark the advancement of survival gameplay, the yes. first universal consequence of death, and the biggest boost to emergent gameplay since 3.0. And they're being joined by both a supporting loot system and new mission types. There's a decent chance something will be delayed, and the execution may not quite live up to the actual features due to instability and bugs. But the movement is there, and features like these continue to push phase four of Star Citizen. I can't development believe I'm taking this long to do this. Pace, in my own opinion. This comes months before I think that's the, the first time I was able to take out a multi tool from that angle. Yet again. Let me rip and it right out. Let me be able to do that before and just never did it. This cargo refactor, along with persistent hangars, are two more very big phase four features that we'll likely hear about at CitizenCon and talk more well, about look later at this that. year. But if you want to hear my thoughts on it already, you can catch this video in the top corner or down in the video description where me and Super Mac off? Brother yeah. Ryan talk about persistent hangars and what All they right. could mean for the game. This wasn't a deep dive on either I'm not of sure these why features I'm doing like this. we've done in the past for things just like because I can, I long guess. distance exploration or the history of the game. But well, we'll because local never works for me. When I put things Twitch in local, they disappear. Talk about Star Citizen three times every week. I'm very excited for this feature, and while one stands out above the other, the community clearly feels the same. For many, this will be considered the first new gameplay in Star Citizen in years, and for all, it will be a big change to the game and the beginning Can of Star Citizen, I guess so. the survival game. All right, that was a quick video. Now I gotta find something. Else. Let's see what they pick. If you enjoyed this enough, please consider subscribing to my channel here and my second channel with more weekly content, Space Tomato 2. 
And if you like this more than enough, you can support me below on Patreon or PayPal. And check out my new podcast, which discusses more weekly news with Super Mac Brother, Astro Pub, and other special All guests. All right, let's go. And remember to go back in this video and look for the secret Rearm code and to my big giveaway. Do it again. When this channel reaches 25,000 subscribers, I will be giving away three copies of Star Citizen with the Hercules Starlifter, Cutlass Black, and Mustang Alpha. You could win any of these. Just follow the link in the video description and keep an eye out for secret codes across YouTube, Twitch, and Twitter. I hope you learned something from this video, and I'll catch you later. And thanks to my top supporters TK, Ken Garcia, Valiant15, The Alpaca, Holston Coop, The Huntress, Dasek, Guilty Conscious, Extreme Tuber7, El Gordo, Jarzy, Niku, Jin, and Bilal El Yasin. You unloaded those yellow jackets. <laughs> Let's go help people customize Two size and ones and two size ones. Okay, who sat at my desk? Oh, I love commercials, let me tell ya. Hello and welcome. Star Citizen. Board game. Stream 116. Playing Vandal Swarm on Dying Star. The map is big. It's all changed. So <laughs> me and Zin are Steel Legion. We're both in I Steels. do feel like I'm not sure how well they're gonna do. The ambient uh, sound is shot up against Vandal, but I suspect they're pretty good. We want to see how like durable they are in real terms and, and that sort of stuff. And it's very pretty now. Dying Star. Look at it. Just follow it. See, I'm just following it. You're firing missiles. Is it against one vandal? Is that one solitary vandal? Mm -hmm. Let me so test it real quick about before I get back. The person at the moment, mate. You're doing. You are doing a great job. Thanks. You made him turn nope. into a giant spanner. Up, oh, yep. That's my special ability. <laughs> it is. I've turned you into a spanner. Oh, there's like little lightning blasts going on. I thought it was glitching. But I suppose it's the, the effects they may be wanting some of the pyro clouds. Because Dying Star, for people who don't know, is supposed to be set in pyro. That's actually... Oh, no. 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 Ow. Is in they shot me with missiles? Shoot them back. I, well, miss, shoot them back with missiles? Yeah, anything. <laughs> I kind of want to watch, see you what are, they're doing. You are very missile happy today. Yeah, well, this thing's got a lot of missile. It does have a reasonable amount of missiles. <laughs> a reasonable amount of missiles. It's also got a lot of forward-facing firepower. And we're not making use of the top main turret um, or the rear turret. Or or the the are they in the turrets. Yeah. steel? Turrets. So people are... At People were complaining about those mounted turrets not being able to track targets. Well, because they're for the, ground targets. Um, Cutlass is flying around. Because that's not what they're for. But Oops, wrong I button. I don't think it's supposed to. No, it's not. Like, let me track. be more specific. It's like trying to hit so, a Huey with an M60. It's it's hard to hit. That's moving fast. When you are manning And you're turrets, moving fast. The steel is moving. Yeah. Um, and it should be. But, I mean, my, my suggestion to that is don't move the Cutlass steel very much. Or set up. Uh, it's, it's like a it's like a little a little defensive outpost when it's firing against things on the ground. I thought they make it like surely they're meant for like you say infantry. Yes. Yeah, it's supposed to be anti-infantry, and you're supposed that. to like lock down at areas and for suppression. So you shouldn't need to move it too much. And when the cutlass steel isn't moving, you you can you can shoot your stuff. Really live. Yeah. Um, and you shouldn't really be not... using those turrets no, for this isn't fighting live. ships, really. Well, the thing is, is that why not if you can, though? Yeah, I suppose. Well, uh, yeah, <laughs> but... I mean, they, they, they haven't got the most ammo, so... I'm um, so... I still can't believe you have to fly I'm, from I'm the bottom seat only. I'm how well only. this is performing. I mean, I'm in just constant gas cloud. This area is massive now. Mm. Um, Let me get a lot this on. character's stuff up. I think... So it's, uh, it's nice that it's performing reasonably well. And recording and stuff as well. 
So I wonder how often NPCs are gonna be down there. And that's something new. Unfortunately, I'm out of ammo. Oh. Oh yeah, I'm nearly out of my uh, secondary weapons. So I gotta go collect some. Um. This guy is just. I'm not sure if he's flying or just spinning. Let me put him out of his misery. I mean, you, I run out of ammo almost instantly with the ballistics in this. I need to, I need to use them more sparingly. I think... It feels like I've got a all... I'm going to... Um, energy weapon build, but obviously... Keep that in there, and I'm going to... Get the car with the other account. I'm trying to run this guy down. I'm not sure if I like the lighting effects. So it's I may try to try to do one more mission. The lighting. We got a helmet on, right? So I mean, the problem I have with this map Oops. is there are no stars. What about that dying star? Okay, apart from those, <laughs> like Stupid. you look out into the void and it's just black. Okay, yeah, I see what you mean. It's um, harder to find reference points for... I'm not used to hearing all this ambient sound. Okay. Oops, it might be because... I can't remember, because it's been a while since I did the lore on it, but um, one of the systems is actually kind of uh, obscured by a nebula. A black nebula. This guy is just getting further and further away. It's because it's cause he's been injured. Oh, I see the, the, the floating pieces of debris and stuff. That they are in the background. Why don't you just launch a missile in? I wanted to shoot him. There we go. Make sure you get that ammo. Yeah. Oh no, I don't want to. No, I'm sorry, Sid. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What? I haven't done anything. Oh no, I'm going too fast. I'm going too fast. Stop, 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 stop. We get next to No, 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 no. Get 72% off NordVPN's uh. two year plan. That's only $3.29 per month. It's our Christmas deal to make your spirits bright. Get the limited time I'm offer now. In it. Where is the other oh, they are? You are part of my happy memories. So this is a book of a bunch of different stories just from my life. Oh boy. That's me at about five years old. I would be receiving a question every minute. You're gonna be oh fine, you're gonna be fine. Okay, that simulation. Make sure my car way, has okay. everything it needs. La 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 it's la. Okay. It's pretty cool. I kind of prefer okay. the whole you've got this many seconds to get out. Yes, rather than just it's a hard one. do one yeah, more mission. There we go. That's how far I mean, away he was. It's it's a weird sort of area. The lighting's weird. I mean, I, I don't hate it, but sometimes it I looks a bit... I forgot which one I came out of. Oops. I don't know. There are also hard two stars. Well, there were two stars last time I did a recording of this. So you've got the dying Blood star. Shot. Um, but there was also another star somewhere. So, I always assumed that the dying star was a planet getting blown. I thought it was like Pyro One getting blown up. You would have thought so. Yeah, sun. there's the other star. Sun. Um, Which then becomes mm. the coil. So yeah, there's some first there's time some out this patch. We already in, already knew. Now is it? Can the Cutlass deal dogfight? Why are you trying? Is it the nebula or the clouds here obscuring my senses at all? Or is that irrelevant? Oh, you can't shut it now! Ah, oh, really? I don't know. They did mess with it. Did I already hit shut? No. It doesn't stack. Ah, oh, that's not good. I like that thing jumping back up before I even get back in the ship. No, 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 be kind, be kind, be kind. Friend, 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 friend. That kind of sucks. Friend, 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 friend. friend. You're right, mate. I did read something about that in the patch notes, but I thought they were talking about something else. That might, they might have been talking about something else. They just fixed, fixed that. Thanks a lot. I love that that came back up while you were still getting down. Less chance for people to get in it. 
I'm fine, Sin. Sorry, this is my concentration, no, 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 everything's okay sounds. Thank you very much, ship. See, my ship congratulates me. Why can't you congratulate me, Sin? Why do you always hate me? Jesus. Give me a chance, will ya? Me? You're a strong, independent Just woman. Just got here. <laughs> They're all dead. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, they've turned up now. You're doing, you're doing great. Oh my god. So good. You're the best. There's seven missiles on me. Why do people keep popping off my radar? You probably... No, I'm just going to open it up. I'm not even gonna wait for full shields. Now. Oh, I lost a few frames there. Hopefully, the next one's gonna drop me off at Bezdek. Uh, Eat, I guess I can fill up on the diamonds. Now, Ryder. What's Ryder have? I think Ryder has diamonds. But at least. Am I caught on something? Huh. Share. Hit the carcass of a ship. Accepted. Alright. Oh Let's no, oh on. no, I'm getting blown up. Oh you're, no. You're gonna be fine, you're gonna be fine, you're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. Just evade, evade, evade. Evade, evade, evade. Evade, evade, evade. You good? I think you're good. I think it gets in, I think it did. Go find some spanners, mate. No, I'm good for. I just picked up a spanner. I need some uh, ammo, mate. Okay. Out of me ballistics. I'm having this ammo, you can have the rest. It, it's one of my badges. Ba one of your badges? What's a badger? <laughs> ah! So it's a. Uh, a small animal in the UK, Jeez. they carry TV. <laughs> in the so UK. It's a size 2 energy weapon. Right, well, one of them's out. So, unless it's been disabled, maybe? Damaged. Damaged. Oh, that sucks. Huh. Probably. He's like, get that. Zin, they're shooting me and I got no shields. Well, try not. <laughs> try not. They're also shooting me and I've got no shield. They suck. Ah! Whoa, that was close. So my left control, it's I think okay, I so spilled something, because it's just, how, how I can't stop going down like. sometimes, I just keep going. Alright. Stop shooting in front of me, you little... <laughs> oh, I'm, ow, I'm, ow, ow. I'm blown. I'm blown. <laughs> Nice. Sin, I get blown up as well. I'm uh, games. where is my mission? Doesn't that work? I can't close the doors. Well, not you. <laughs> Are the doors really not going to close? I'm trying. And why can't I see the mission? Try harder. Sin. <laughs> no, no, no. Don't be angry at me. This is what they want. This is what oh, they here want. There we go. Collect package. Okay, I can't do anything until the door's closed. At least move, be moving. Yes. Yes. Repaired by 72%. Why are the door's not right, closing? Where are you? Right, I'll shoot you. They opened. Thanks, in. That's why I employ you. To keep you alive. To, to take I my guess I can do it with this. So, things are messed up a little bit. Oof. Oh, yeah, that was right in my nose. He exploded. No. Perfect. We're, we're Lucky I have a helmet on. <laughs> in this particular instance. We are potentially top three. Top three pilots in this instance. I wish I had my other guns. They've fallen off. Oh, no, please tell me they're not broken. No, no, they're not repairing. Okay, for oh, some reason, 
second. Maybe you'd blow up then. For some reason, no. my key bind to close the doors are not working oh, regularly. It opened them it. just fine, but. Is it? Yeah. Okay. So it's still early in the week. Oh, who's shooting at me? Sorry, it's this guy. Ooh, stop. You're still close enough to use your ship. I'm spinning. I'm spinning. <laughs> see, see it help me. I can't help my, you. Nobody my can ship's help you opens. Now. Really still close enough to, to the station? I can see you spinning. I guess so. I got an assist. Oh, oh no, 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 I'm spinning. What oh, is okay, that? I can read, oh, oh, sugar. I think that's the. No. <laughs> oh, I can't. I keep. This is oh. impossible to. Oh, this I think that's the Pisces. I'm wondering if I change the orientation of my engine till I have more luck. Yes! Yes, I got a spanner! My engine's back! Right, right, come here. That works. It's okay, I'm gonna help you. Oh no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, gonna explode. No, 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 you're gonna be fine. <laughs> Is that you exploding to? Yeah. Okay. okay. Not ideal, admittedly. Not not the best ship for combat. Well, especially when we're flying them. Look, I'm, I'm sure people can do great. Oh, Zin. Okay. Oh, I've got, oh no, the other engine's gone this time. We're spinning again, Zin. Sorry, there's a, there's a spanner over here. I'll get that other guy. Thanks, mate. Get that other guy. Where's the spanner? I don't know why I'm getting in this. I probably it's should. Me. Well, it's okay. so there's an NPC it's down there. Whoa. Okay. I, I, oh. Ay, ay, ay. Go on, you really, can make it. You can make it. It's really, really hard to control. All right, let's get this going. <laughs> did you get it? Yeah, I did. Good, good, good. I, I'm running effectively with just one batter at the moment. You have loads of missiles. Yeah, thank you. you. Want some missiles? Woo. Yes, I'd love some missiles. Please. I have peanut M&Ms. Oh. Don't know why he's speaking a bit like Mickey Mouse. Okay, this is the last yes. mission. Brother called me. I'm gonna call my brother back. I've lost, uh, I've lost some sound, but it's okay. Because I'm still, I'm still getting the, them sweet, sweet kills. And so I would say that the Cutlass steel is pretty durable. Like, <laughs> uh, it's, it's take. <laughs> Are you okay, Sid? Yeah, he flew into me. So does it have more armor? Oh, oh no, oh no! Is that? No, is I'm it just? Again. I'm spinning out. Is there somebody I'm down there again? Out. We die, we die. This is the second time I've seen somebody on this mission. Yes. I went the entire it's last patch with never seeing wars. anybody down here. It doesn't matter if you're Ever. Of games, as long as the spanners, spanners are kind. I think that's a real person ship that's just not in it. Starfighter. So yeah, I don't know if it's an ion, so is it's gonna hurt if he starts oh. shooting at me. Is your, uh, is your back door open? No, my back door is not open. Mine is. No. I think it got blown open in an earlier engagement. Oh man. Yeah. 
seem it seems to be able to hold its own a bit better than I thought it was going to against the load of the little ships. Yeah, I do think it's a little bit weak, um, shield and armor wise. Like I get blown up quite easily. Well, it's a drop ship. Oh, okay. Have you tried uh, avoiding getting shot? Mm -hmm. a bit? <laughs> Who has time for that? Apparently not you. Gonna land and say I come in peace or something, I guess. You are soon. I don't know if the turret's gonna shoot at me or not since somebody's already there. I'm gonna find out in a hundred meters. The starfighter go away? I think the starfighter went away. Oh, I need to get to that. I need to get to the spammer. I'm good. I'm good. Maybe he logged off. He got killed it and left. All right, I gotta be dumb and go use the facilities as fast as I can. Where's this guy? I'm gonna try to land. Okay, back to Collide with what? What are they talking about? I guess I am close to the ground. One of my badges is out. Me, I've been dealing with one badger since like round three or something. Sometimes the car gets on my nerves when I land it. What? You beat me in score? No, 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 no. You're not even on my scoreboard. That's how bad you are. Oh. 300 more points. No, 300 Did I not hit landing gear? I didn't hit landing gear. You had three. This is, this is not, this is not how this should work. <laughs> well, I was obviously throwing myself into the heart of battle. You were, you were. That was appreciated when you saw the semi rescue. I can't tell where I am. You said semi. <laughs> I did. Well, that's the new... Sort of dying star map. We're just messing around. Uh, they got the steel. I, I think, think I'm on a sure. hill. I think Zin would uh, disagree. I'm um, much more derpy at evasion. Um, but, uh, so I, I, will, I will spin and do weird things. Um, not necessarily any form of pro maneuver, but a maneuver. Oh shit! What the heck? I, I suppose, Why I can't I just land? Larger ships like the car does not like to just land. I tell you what. Uh oh, I think I'm on something. What is your favorite little fighter? I'm, I'm uh, at the Hornet, but I need to swap the weapons out on it, really. I've got the default loadout. I do uh, feel that if we had switched out the ballistic weapons here for uh, energy weapons, mm. um, then... Am I um, too close? I think I'm fine. So I have to get up for a second. I mean, it's, it's, it's a cutlass. I think it's, I think it's pretty good. I think it's pretty useful. Uh, the, turn the lights you out. Like you would with the cutlass in, in a variety of situations. Well, this However... When it's got 18 people inside, that's precious car game, mate. That is precious car game. Anyway, I'd be back. So much appreciate. Hope you enjoyed. Let YouTube sure play. You check Whatever out, um, plays next, Vandal plays Pirate next. On the uh, Dying Star and um, Broken Broken Moon maps. Broken Star, Dying Moon. What? A, what? That, that's new levels to come. Um, thanks very much for watching. Zin, Zin, say say goodbye, Zin. Goodbye, Zin. Tell us what you think in the comments. Are you enjoying the Star Citizen? Have you played Rune Commander recently? Do you hate it? Do you love it? Are you waiting for Theatres of War? What are your thoughts? Comment down below for a chance to win a ship. Ho, ho, ho. I'm a fat man with a beard, and I'm going to sneak down your chimney and give you NordVPN. That's right. I'm Board Gamer. I am that fat man with a beard. And it's Nordmus. So what do you want in your stocking for Nordmus, little Timmy? I want NordVPN with its useful security, privacy, and locational spoofing features. I also want a racing car set. <laughs> of course you do. But as I'm not sponsored by racing car set, maybe you should shut your f little mouth, Tim. Merry Nordmus. For December, we are giving away an Origin 400i with a Star Citizen game package and lifetime insurance. This is a luxury multi-role explorer ship for one to three players to run together. It's like a little yacht in space. All you need to do to be in for a chance of winning that is comment 
on any of my videos made during December. If you'd like to further support the channel, please consider clicking that join button underneath my videos. You can also become a Patreon or even donate. Thank you so much for watching. Please take care and I'll see you in the verse. What can give you a competitive edge in today's red hot housing market? Rocket can. Go to rocketmortgage.com. Rocket. Call for cost information and conditions. Equal housing lender. Licensed in all 50 states. NMLSconsumeraccess.org number 3030. Good <laughs> afternoon slash evening, everybody. Hey, Kiel, 10K, Matthew, Unwind, Xperia, Xperia, you of all people. <laughs> Lodix, Cap, how you guys doing? Zebo, BTR, Moon, good to see ya. Hey, there's the road. BTR, Steve. I got a I got a link to drop on you guys. I got a link to drop on you guys. Hey guy, Malcolm, Adam. Actually, hold on, hold on. I need to see I need to see if something works. Does that work? Let's see if that works. Hey Shin, how you doing, buddy? I don't know if that works. There we go. There it is. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. I put in an R command for for the Mongrel Squad channel. I uh, they they actually just dropped a video not too long ago of that hit from a few days back. Experience, I didn't realize that you guys have been tailing me for days. That was that was ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, man, that was. Oh, that was a good hit. I didn't I didn't realize I had a tail for that long, you know. Hey, Jasper. Hey, Robert. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was that was wonderful. Also, Darren, good to see you, man. Oh, oh, that was that was a good hit. That was a good hit. And yeah, man, they they spent days and days on that. That was that was a lot of research. That was a good hit. That was a clean. Hey, Edwin. Good to see you, man. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day today. Or at the very least, you know, <coughs> a dollar of one. Oh, did you kill? Nice. Yeah, let me let me finish the stream and I'll check it out. I actually, oof, I've got a bunch of messages I need to catch up on on Discord. I've been I've been bad. I've been I've been.
really bad. <sighs> really bad. Why? I'm sorry, like, I know I'm super Boy, chatty on here, and then it takes me forever to, uh, to respond to things on Discord. Sounds times. like Jack Axton. I don't know which one it's playing, but... Alright, so what are we doing today? I think the same thing we do every day. You know what I like? Okay, so, so check this out. So check this out. Drake Caterpillar, right? Medium Freight. Crusader, C2 Hercules Starlifter. Courier. <laughs> Courier. Courier. <laughs> hey, dump truck. Oh, Robert, that's Guess a I'll check the door when I get there. Also, I am coming through, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. OBS says I'm coming through. I'm just making sure. Uh, and what do I have on me? I have a pistol, I have my thing, I'm good to go. Didn't K, I'm not gonna lie, they're nice. That's on they me personally, okay, nice. I can, if I get killed, the other We're gonna use ours today to make some money. I thought me. that was Camerol, that must be Camerol's evil twin. Zamorol. Let's just be safe. <laughs> exactly, BTR, like, what is it, what is it, uh, quarrying here, you know? Come on. I got you, Robert. Oh, I hate that. Why do I keep hitting here? that one? Hey, Fallen. Good to see you, man. That's it, Moon. Totally not, uh, you know, sentence you want. Uh, Campbell, I think, I think there might be one or two others listed as a courier. I'd have to, uh, you know, go in and check. I do not like that they messed with That's the ramp it. button. That's it. I can't make it come back up until it's all the way down now. Which I guess that's how they wanted it in the first place, and people probably complain. Because if you ah, click it again... No, oh, man, I need to see when I can get mine. This makes it more time-consuming. Yeah. Snack, that's 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 the problem with this ship. Like that thing has been bugged since since it released, you know? And uh they haven't fixed it. But I find it Did they awesome. speed it up? I feel like it got down there awfully fast. They Ooh. they sped it up. Oh, Gandera, that's uh They did speed it up. The, the G twelve. So I okay, applaud just, that. How do you feel about, you know, going origin? They did speed it up. Mm, hold up, let's see what we got. Prospect. I don't think I have to worry about that prospector waylaying me anytime soon. Oh, I should, I should double bring the other guy down, down too. I don't know why I kept him Xperia, up there. Is uh, you in the pack hunting today, or am I am I going to be okay this time, unaccosted? <laughs> I don't know why I left yeah, this character up there. Bad. If you're looking for something right now, it's probably going to be a cyclone or or uh, or an Ursa. Let's just I'm just going to check the server right quick. Oh, Man, it is so loud in a car wreck when it's off. Like I'm Something going through a cave. Might be okay. For now, anyway. Or a tunnel, rather. I have no idea why I didn't go out first. Oh, see, that sounds, that sounds nice. And hey, Deep Six. Yeah. Man. I'm sorry about that, too, man. I am sorry about that, too. Man, not bad. I actually just finished watching oh, that, shit. Uh, that hit from. Uh, I didn't think that would hurt so bad. From mongrels, that was that was a clean hit. That was a, a beautiful. That I was have a beautiful oh boy. Mark, you know. Oh, I gotta get off the lift. Not yet, Robert. Not yet. I think she's building up some money again. And yeah, deep. They really did. She actually. Uh, I think I can send it, right? <laughs> Crumpet put out a fun little video on Twitter. She wanted to record... Um, blowing up a few gift boxes. I'm gonna go pick up some food from Galette and see what Hicks is, uh, is doing. Alright, I'm picking up boxes, not assaulting yeah, the station. Yeah, Deep, they really did. You're a mean one. 
CIG. I love it when the first box is right there. Away. Please don't knock that down. Still coming down? I could actually do some lyrics there, but I can't. I can't. Fly uh, I guess I didn't click it at the same time. I have a very where? Wow, really? I don't have a, a, a multi processing brain. I mean, shoot, I can barely fly and, and read text at the same time, you know? Oh, shit. You know, Gold, that's, that's the thing. I actually like the mist cockpits, they feel truckery. To me, you know, like I don't need to look up and down all the time. Like I'm not pulling off ridiculous combat maneuvers in a in a misc ship, you know, or at the very least a freelancer or or starfarer. Man, that is a lot of rocks. That is a lot of rocks. Like I actually like the mail slot view. Now I know a lot of people don't, but you know, that's that's okay that they don't. But I, I like it, you know? It makes me feel like I'm in Space Truck Simulator. I mean, it's still more visibility the than... The sound is the way Tesla off! Flight simulator. I guess I should let them kill some people. Ugh, I didn't get some armor. Stuff. Like, this guy, I want this guy in the yellow to die, so I can take his armor. It was on my M.2 when I uh, rebuilt my computer. And I lost it <coughs> when reinstalling the OS. Hey, Toby, good to see you, man. Sorry, I was having to land there. Hey, Panda, not bad. We actually just got started not too long ago. That's it, Gutierrez. And the profit shrank by 75%. Hey, Moonshadow. Moon hey, Ron. Shadow. Okay, so those little white diamonds. Uh, yeah. I guess the one jump. Where is he at? Up, uh, if it's the little light blue ones, those would be the orbital markers. Sorry about that, Rob. Let me uh, let me get back into the cockpit after I buy this uh, this stuff, and you'll, if you can, point it out to me again. Because the little white ones that pop up before the rocks do—that's just my scanners pinging for uh, for mineable rocks. Yeah, the sound is jacked you know, up. Oh, Halon, God, no, I, I, Halon, I, I have no discipline, man. I bought the C2 a very long time ago. Good night, 456. You know, that was 423 last night. Yep, the honeymoon period's over. People are no longer on those boxes. Where are they shooting from? Yeah, you know, nobody Golden over here. The uh, the combines hardcore. Combines. Ooh, mad. What, what, are, we, what, are, we talking? what are we talking? Orange chicken? He just appeared, dude. Sesame? Anderson, Did I just much. disappear? Uh, actually, hold on. Hold on. Let me see. Does this come Now I guess. In... <sighs> Where am I going? Why am I dead, dead? Let me see if that works. What? This game? Oh, I'm in the car act. But still. I don't think it works. Alright, I have to go get armor. What did I put in for that? I Hold on. think I, I can this. walk outside like this. Oh, it did work. Okay, there it is. Yeah, uh, you can actually see the profits well projected. But I have another character right there the to... Hey, friendly. Yeah. You know what? Don't and put that on the elevator. Rob, I got a feeling when they're on the elevator, they disappear. We get in the air so we can actually move around. I don't have a rifle. Talk about those little tiny white diamonds off to the right there. Those are things that are picking up on radar, but haven't actually been identified yet. So those are most likely going to be rocks. I'm going to fly closer to them just to confirm that they're rocks and not, you know, ships waiting to, you know, school. Yeah, see, those are, those are mineable ones now. You would need a prospector or a mold in those. Now, sometimes it'll end up being a ship, but very rarely. Now, if you're talking about these, once they turn blue, 
that is a location that you can jump to. It's red because we're too close to the ground. It turns blue, like so, we can jump to it. Okay, so this just got stupid. You know Hopefully my body's still there. Because it really, really And I don't know if I'm gonna take damage hey, on Marcus. Hurston walking naked there. What's up, buddy? You know, Marcus, I have no idea. I have I am no a little idea. mad. Uh, right? uh, DJ, this is this is the C2. C2 Hercules. Hey, Jesus! Yeah, I do like my hurt. I do like my hurt. You know, Marcus, I don't know what I want for Christmas. I. Yeah, but I'm it's thinking, Hurston. I think you can walk in Hurston. Okay, I mean, let's be honest. You guys have already done so much for me when it comes to like PC upgrades. Like I got, I got a whole new build okay. essentially because of you guys. You know, like what more can I ask for? Like a pet moose. And like, YouTube will pay out around the 20th. And, uh, you know, I, I'll be putting that towards towards a graphics card. And really, that's just finding one to get, you know? Like, I'll be able to get that because of you guys. I might eventually end up going with a new case. Uh, Biffbo. Man, oh man. Recommending an excellent case from Cooler Master that was really cheap, but had some 200 millimeter fans. Because uh, it turns out, as old as my case is, it might not fit some graphics cards. Yeah. Because uh, my case is from like 2012. Oh, that's I mean, rough. I bought it in like 2017, but you know it's an old build. But it's a it's a heck of a case, you know. But uh, yeah. cannot believe that I got shot yeah, in the I back. Know. I did not see. I didn't clear that box. He was waiting. Did they turn the AI up, or am I just that bad? That's it. That's that's that's. What and I again, I can't I see, see the here. bodies yeah. that the other account can see. Hey, Bobo Vasquez. So I'm naked out here. You know, I am. I am doing all right. Uh, negative, Marcus. I'm actually in PU right now. We that's fine. I don't money. care. I dipped into PTU a little bit, man. I'm just. I don't know. It doesn't really feel like it's worth poking around. You know? I want heavy. <laughs> I'm gonna put the heavy armor on. <laughs> I didn't want. I oh know. I want my body hey, back. This thing grab a rifle. While I look for my body. Where's my? I want. That's what I want. And yeah, G stance like the C two is worth so much money right now. You know. And yeah, DJ like the you know the Spartan. The Spartan's a fun fun little truck. But you definitely need something to to, to drive it around in. Trying to get a screenshot. Move! Yeah, Robert, good luck with the drive, man. It goes all right. See, exactly, Boobikins. Although, maybe not literally. Uh, that's a good screenshot. Alright, let's like go. Go boom, boom. We'll get my body back. Ugh. But what? Yeah, he was right I there. Know, Marcus, like, I've, I've always been kind of hard, though. To get stuff for. Like, let me, let me tell you a story. Like, when I was a kid, like, there wasn't really a lot that I wanted. Except, you know, maybe, like, Transformers or something. Well, that like, worked. Sort of becoming like a like a teenager or, or you know young teenager. Like it wasn't even really that. All right, what do you guys think? Seventeen thirty four. Hey, seventeen sixteen. Yeah, that's a fair amount. That that could be worth. Is that your rifle? I'm good enough there. I think there's your rifle. Yeah, why not? We're gonna we're gonna <coughs> we're gonna. Why? Run God, so annoying. There we go. We're All right, here we go again. Back to square one. I don't see any yellow suits for the other account. Oh, thank you, Boot. Yeah, let me switch to live chat real quick. Hold on. There we go. All right. Now they'll just appear in here. Hey, guess. Oh, the trap should be. 
Oh, but Gaz, we're in the C2. No tractor beams here. Hey, Belle. Man, it's, it's been all right so far. You know, Belle, um, I fancy you say that. My day was actually made marginally better uh, by the release of a particular Mongrel Squad video. Let me just, let me just link that. You guys can watch this, whatever. They finally put out the video of them hitting me the other day. Man, they had actually been tracking me for days, dude. Days. Oh, man. Absolute days. There's no other boxes. I think those were the last of the boxes. Oh, PH, I didn't even see it, man. I swear, every time you die, it messes up everything. Oh, yeah. Hey, Lon. Hey, Lon, do you need a, do you need a ship? Do you just have the... Uh... Oh, well, I guess I'm done because I think the, the prospector boxes are messed up. Hey, Liddy. Uh, unfortunately not, no. Buying ships from other players is sadly not a thing yet. I don't know if that's ever going to be a thing. I wish it was. Yeah, hey, Lon. Uh, tell me about your fleet, man. Is that all you got right now is that prospector? Because, like, we can help you out, buddy. Oh, get you here. That sucks, man. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, Joe. They did, so bad they about that. Easy, especially since they've been chasing me for so long. What they did, what did they end up with, I wonder? Oh, oh here we oh, go. Yeah, we got you, man. We got you. How many, how many orders do you have at the refinery, dude? How many orders you got? What the heck? Yeah, Colin, you enjoy it? You know, we like to, we like to haul around here. I've moved a couple of boxes. Uh, Adriel, that depends. I know a Joe. I know Johnny Joe. I don't know if that's the same Joe. I also happen to know a Cotton Eye Joe. You know, if it wasn't for that guy. Cotton Eye Joe. I've been married a long time ago. I'm sorry. I couldn't, I couldn't help myself. You know, Dayton, there's not, there's not really a lot in 316 that has me super excited. Like, the grab lever work is nice, and I don't know, maybe jump town will keep people out of the trade lanes and going there for drugs, so maybe trade will be a little bit easier, but we're eh. looking forward to stuff coming in 317, but oh, yeah, 316 yeah. is a holiday patch, and those are always kind of light, and I'm okay with that. You know, it's like, go take a break, CIG. Be back in January. Feel it. I mean, I'll grab armor, but I'd rather not. Yeah, see, Joe? Joe Loy, like, there's, there's a I'd rather wait until the yellow jokes. armor becomes available. Yeah, Halon, I'm sorry about that. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Hey, good luck with class, Momo. I don't, know, I don't know if you're still here. Good luck with class. And yeah, Dancy Pants, like, right now, technically, uh, trading is the worst way to make money between the big three, like bounty hunting, mining, and trade. It is kind of bad. You can probably make more with skimmer missions than you can trade with. I mean, I still make okay Apple, money Apple because you already have money. So I guess uh, I gotta wait for these boxes know. to respawn. Oh, are they man. respawning? No, those are going to be a long time from now. Like, realistically, we're probably looking at years. Yeah, DJ, they, they nerfed the gifts. They nerfed the gifts. Bad. Oh, Dayton, I'm sorry, man. Dayton, there's, there's a workaround for that. Uh, there's a few people who know that workaround, but I'm gonna... Here, quick demonstration. So let's say you want to mess with your MFDs. Like, I want to mess with that one or, or whatever, but, you know, you keep accidentally selecting... Stuff like like this, you know. Oh, I want to see so this what you do Is you hold your interact button. Uh, like so ah. While holding it, middle mouse button. This will zoom you in. Quick demonstration. So let's say you want to mess with your MFDs. Like I want to mess with that one. Yeah, I can or, never or, touch that you one. Keep accidentally selecting the other one. Yeah. Stuff like like this, you know. So what you do is you hold your interact button, like so. 
while holding it, middle mouse button. Okay. Let's zoom oh. in. Still holding your interact button. So once again, hold interact, <laughs> middle mouse button, and then you can use WASD to move around between all your MFDs and change them. Now, the problem is, if you move your mouse off the MFD and you start getting that, most of the time you're going to have to repeat the whole process. Yeah, but that's bad. Interact. I can't believe button. that they can fix that either. And we, can just, we can just change between anything. Okay. That's, that's how you get around that. Okay, can I get get around a box now? Oh, don't want to go that way. Which way did I just come from? Yeah, you know, Lucky, that's fair. That's fair about those surface bounties. Those actually do seem like they'd be kind of nice. It's nice to get some more atmospheric. I forgot the atmosphere. I wanted to try that. I completely forgot about the atmospheric hey, bounties. Hey, it's been a long time no see, buddy. Well, you just oh, did one. You killed one with a Pisces. You know, G-Stance. I just realized uh, I was atmospheric. As far as that goes, my dream ship. I kind of want to mess around with the Kraken, you know? Like, Big. It's got tons of cargo. It's just such a, such a imposing ship. Like you see that thing pulling into port with its nearly 4,000 SCU of cargo. You know that thing is about to lay down some economic devastation. Ugh. Exactly, Gaz. I guess exactly. I'm not gonna be able to finish this because the box yeah, is that, little, that box isn't gonna out. spawn. I swear that other one wasn't there and it spawned after the fact. So. I don't know how long you have. Grab all them gifts. I wish they would just change it to all of the boxes hey, can be want, taken. You just need three of them. Rent a ship that way you don't have to worry about them despawning or... Your, your refined cargo, huh? Just for gameplay purposes. Yeah, that's what we can do F4. We got that fancy dance skin on here right now. I kind of miss the Draco skin. Not a lot of people don't like it. You know, Moon, I would move 4,000 SCU in barrel. Really, at that point, if I can have 4,000 SCU, I don't care what it is. I'll move iodine. That respawn. Okay, and hopefully, that's the one you need. Well, you know, Envy. Yep, it uh, is. I grew up with mouse and keyboard on various games. So I think I think that's what it is, really, for me. Um, I'm just so used to it, you know? Like, I used to do Flight Simulator. With a mouse and keyboard, let me tell you how hard that was. I want the yellow to come by. I want to get a yellow guy. In the year 2000. In the year 2000. I wanted to open back and up. Jar, yeah, Kraken is the carrier. And you know, TJ, eh. as far as the privateer goes, like, I. Oh, this is going to be a bad jump. Oh, this is a bad jump. There goes my frames. I like the idea of the privateer, although I'm not picking one. I, I guess I'm not nice gonna get yellow armor. Step up or competitor to the merchant. Level. But I just want to move straight cargo. That's freaky. And yeah, Adriel, yeah, this is the C2. I was gonna try to make it trip. And get to yours. I have not got to use the tongue in space. I have been, I have been tongue. I thought I could make it trip again, make up some more people come out, but I guess I can't. All right, no yellow armor. Yeah, you see, Dancy, um, I got my start for Flight Simulator. I'm not going to get a CS 2000. so that guy can get yellow armor. Um, uh oh. That was, you know, with Flight Sim 95. All right. I had a mouse. And let me tell you how hard it was to fly that sop of camel with a mouse. That was difficult. But I learned. And then there was the demo for Tachyon the Fringe. Ah, and then I finally got the full game years and years later. I know, none of the good ones. I didn't get oh, the yellow yeah, or the new the armor. Mess. Hey, A1M2M. I, I don't know if I can say that whole thing. I'm not getting I'm going to be done after this. Hey, you have it. How you doing, bud? Oh, yeah, see, DJ, um, I didn't get to play the full game for years. I had a demo disc from Earthlink. Earthlink, them, wow. Earthlink. I so forgot. I just had to replay it. the demo over and over and over for like five years. <laughs> and then finally, my, my grandfather got an eBay account, and I bought a used copy on eBay. And I was so excited to finally play the full game. And I think I think that's where my love of Drake ships comes from, because the Drake ships really remind me of like the Bora mining ships from, uh, from Tachyon. They just have that cobbled together feel to them. 
Uh, you know, Sarge, I did not. I didn't actually get to play any Chris Roberts games. In fact, uh, my first Chris Roberts anything was the movie Lord of War. Oh boy. With Nicolas Cage. That was my first. That was Chris Roberts? Chris Roberts experience. <laughs> like, I, I never even that. heard of Chris Roberts until, until we started this. Alright. Alright, so give me one second. Let me land. And then I will catch up on chat because you should not text and drive at the same time. So we're going to slot the battery here. Nice and easy. Oh, you know what? Oh, yeah, this one wouldn't heal. I healed this one. Easy peasy. Uh, T Jack. I don't know. That is a good question. I would be willing to test it, but you would have to give me a few hours. Oh, Dante, I have seen space truckers. I love space truckers. Uh, Adriel, I am a I am a mouse and keyboard warrior. Sorry, I'm catching up on all the all the chat here. Uh, the heck? But, uh, yeah, no. Um, I love Space Truckers. I love that movie. I want to find it on Laserdisc just to you know say that I have it on Laserdisc. Why? All right. Thank you, Colin. I've I've certainly done it enough. Oh, I was slightly off center. Dang it. Go to the right. Eh, whatever. Yeah, it is psychotic. It is a it is a fun shit to play. Yes, there is Zolta. In fact, I think it's free on YouTube. Like, I mean, you know, with ads. But yeah, there's a. Hey. No yeah, armor. Jack, like, what? Uh, are you like missing your head or what? I want to finish this, and I will be done. Follow the, uh, it's 696 SCU. I oh, never use this ladder. Mechanics. I mean, as long as you're in the hangar, you're good, right? Yeah, Colin, All right. that's, that's a big problem with the Max. Um, it's a bit of a, of a, of a chunky bucket. But they keep giving you like the regular size hangers for it, so you just have no clearance to your left or right. So it's very easy to tip the wing. And because of the way the thing flies, you do that, usually you end up, you know, bonking out inside the hangar. Hey, Nitric. Engines online. Oh, thank you, man. Yeah, I, uh, man, I, I love watching them work. And occasionally getting hit by them, although not too much. I gotta, I gotta keep the bank account up. But yeah, man, I, I love watching those guys work. They've been after me for a long time. It was, it was, it was high time it finally happened, you know. But yeah, man, I appreciate it, buddy. Thanks for coming by. If I, if I had to, yeah, the fellow box all. I don't know why my Windows button keeps popping up now. It never used to. Oh yeah, DJ, I hate landing the hammerhead. Hate it. Hate it. Hate it. Hate it. I got to T-Jack. Okay, yeah. Yeah, it comes uh, up every time man, now. Just to be safe, I might wait until you can actually sell all those mining orders, which is a pain. I mean, you could try it, ah. but if you've got a bunch of loads going, man, I might, I might just give the Redeemer a bit of a, of a break until you can sell all those. Yeah, okay. I'd go on, I'd be alright with that. Those wings don't really add much except for missile pylons. But yeah, JDS scrap is still scrapped. 
I didn't bother to fix crap. I didn't even think about that. Recycle jokes I can make for state of trade, but CIG is uh, keeping me hard pressed to keep up with it. Hey, dude. Yeah, the money totally isn't worth it for this time. Can I'm using? I can make a butt ton of other money, but you know what? I don't need anything in the game right now. I've had all the ships before in game. I got enough in game now. Let them go. Uh, the biggest weakness with the Carrick is the hangar. Um, if you're uh, an outpost that has no armistice, they can shoot the hangar open and then board from the hangar. But that's only going to matter in places like Humboldt, Gillette, Tram and Myers. If you're trading at an outpost that has an armistice zone, you're going to be okay. Match that with your speed and yeah. There's just no real point to taking a carry. Um, at the same time, the C2 has a lot of speed as well. But there are faster fighters that can keep up. Oh, Diego, you're going to have to sell that widow at Grim Hex, and, and buddy, good luck unloading. That's going to take a very long time. Drugs are in a very bad state. That's it, Dancy. We'll recycle just like Drake. Raised uh, the FPS issue. I mean, I run into it from time to time. That's because I'm taxing my 1070 limits. Hey, Julius. Oh man. I'm so I think I'm going to leave my ship here I'm after sorry. I land. I'm going to log off here. Wherever I leave this. Okay, you can actually uh, you can clear the med bay. That way they uh, <coughs> they can't spawn there anymore. Like, that's the thing, too. Um, I know this sounds silly, but piracy, especially at the moment, but I also feel like in the future, is all about trust. Um, which is why, you know, I kind of get excited when, uh, when I get pirated by Mongo Squad. Because I feel like we've built up that relationship between trader and pirate where we can trust each other to act sensibly and not try to screw each other over. Let's say I did pay them off, and, you know, they just blew me up anyway, because, you know, I could. Well, the next time they hold me up, there's no reason for me to pay if they're just going to blow me up. But yeah, like, you know, you got to have that trust. At the same time, you know, if they know me as a trader who's just going to self-destruct instead of paying then there's no point in holding me up and I just become kill on sight. So, you know, there's there's a lot of trust when it comes to the mugging process. You know, Zolt, I've never actually messed with Razer keyboards. I'm on a Logitech right now. Hey, Lonix. Really, Julius? Yeah, like... I, uh, mine's done excellent so far. It's my GPU that's been bothering me. And, you know, Diego, as far as, as far as the best commodity in an MSR, you're probably looking at something like medical to a major port city. Which I wish I could tell you, like, Laranite or something like that, but Laranite's been very hard to fill up on. Hey, Pagan, what's up, man? Oh, death. Oh, death. Oh, no! Death, you might have to, uh, <coughs> you might just have to take the hit on that, buddy. You might just have to take the hit on that. Oh, no, 10k, they wouldn't do that. Because if they blew me up, you know, take my money and my cargo, then I have less money to trade with. Um, when you're a pirate, your marks are all about conservation. You see, if you kill a guy, you can only rob him once. But if you just rob him and let him go, you can rob him multiple times. What the heck, man? Um, Damn it! was a lesson that uh, was taught very well in... Oh, which, which Discworld book was that? I kind of want to watch Space Truckers now. Oh, uh, it was one with two flower. 
the counterweight continent. What was that? What was that? I don't remember the name of it. Anyway, yeah. If you don't kill a guy, you can rob him multiple times. You know, catch, release, and catch again. It's, uh, it's conservation of resources. Hey, Graham. Good to see you, man. Trigger, you too. Exactly, Kai. Like, let's, let's quote Zed Geef, you know? Like, just because you're a bad guy does not mean you are a bad guy. And Havoc, I mean, it really is. I mean, if you think about it, it's, it's like farming. Like, you have to tend to the crop. You know, Nikki, that's a good question. Let's find out. What is my FPS today? Oh, sir, I'm sorry. Oh, God, it's like a storm. Soul, yes, interesting times. That's what it was. Thank you, Soul. Interesting times. Ah, that was a good book. Also, Two Flowers book, what I did on my holiday. Oh, my God, get off of this thing. Hey, it's all right. Yeah. It's not that yeah, bad. It's 31 it's degrees. That's... Hot, exactly nitrous. Yeah, play your farming. Can't move them both because they don't have auto walk. Exactly, Ding. Shen. I mean, like, you know, they hit me up for 60k, which for the load I oh, have, this is gonna take a while. It's a expensive because like I wasn't gonna really be making a profit. But this is where uh, they invested a lot of time. Not caring about the so you have to think of respawn the bed and just taking and the Pisces comes in a lot cheaper than replacing the entire cargo I had, and not to mention they were like. <laughs> Six of them and only one of me, so my uh, my bargaining position was highly, highly dubious. Really, Graham? That's weird, because I have to downscale it to 10k. Glad it looks good in 4k. Good job, I'm getting a new TV. Yeah, Cap, that's the thing. There's not a lot of people doing piracy because a lot of people think that piracy can't be achieved right now. And oh, the storm can, went away. But it's very difficult, and it takes a group. It takes an organized group. And they're, they're kind of like me when it comes to trading. It's not the most profitable thing, but they do it because they want to. And they want to get good with it. Same with these boxes. I'm just doing it so I can see what the other thing is. Hey, Ellie. Oh, yeah, but you know, that's what we do 90% of the time. Yeah, you know, Coyote, me neither. Me neither. I can't understand why they're so adamant about how much traders are making. I know. You, know, you can make like half a million an hour. Just kill me with this with an fake eye. economy they keep talking about. Dude, there's like no economy. I don't know what they're talking about. Yeah, you see, BH, like, I want, I want a coupon system, you know? I want a coupon. It's like, hey, guys, this is this is my 10th one. Can I get, like, a 50% off? <laughs> coupon system. Yeah, hey, Lon, like, you can still make okay money with trading in Elite. Not, I don't know how I feel about the correct door now. To, uh, how much you can make mining, you know? My goodness. Yeah, if you got patience, man, you can kill it mining. Got to hey, wait a so day and a half uh, to get the big so payout. So, still have the issue where they spawn late. Um, if you can find yourself in a small server with not a lot of people, they spawn a lot quicker. What <coughs> about three? Si He's not in three sixteen doing that. Either. <coughs> exactly, Coyote. Like ships and, uh, and armor and, and guns, but you know I don't really rock a lot of that. Pretty much stay in my noob suit unless I'm gonna go do a, a specific mission for them. And exactly, Nigel. Nice. Like, like that's that's how I feel. Like, you think I trade for the money? <laughs> oh, oh, I do it to fly the ships. I do it to go to interesting places every 20 minutes. Think I'm in this for the money? I mean, technically, yes, but. 
I hate how it still you know, says collect the, the boxes and packages. Amount of money. I mean, it, uh, make yeah, it I should be in the prospector. And if I did it right tonight, I could have some nice point. little payouts for the weekend. I hit three or four little prosper. Uh, what do you call them? All right, yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, with the tacky on the fringe demo. Yeah. Exactly. All right, another twenty-two thousand. Well, at least the missions are spawning boxes now. Yeah, Nikki. Now, now, Nikki, I am gonna tell you, buddy. As far as like the thirty FPS goes, um, I don't know what your setup is right now, but I'm my graphics card is a little dated. I am on a ten seventy. I'm so not getting asked to see because I don't know. Chuck, I'm also streaming on the same card. How much I'm gonna get? Uh, I will be changing. I don't know what it's selling for. Future, uh, probably right at or right after Christmas. I'm so good. If you've got a beefier setup than me, you should be able to see where I am. Like my girlfriend, Grandpa, like she. She'll get like 60 or 70 FPS, even in cynics, you know? Unified distribution. Hmm. I'm a little bit past where I was when we started. The stupid turret firing at me for what seemed like no reason. All right, I am going to log off yeah, here. Yeah, Zelta, you want to be. You want to be a space bear? Yeah, do some free. I am going to try to land a ship. Actually, I'm going to land right next to the. Uh, Colin, it was actually just last patch or this patch. Landing pad. Before uh, that, you know they went for do a solid this. 18 months. Battery reset. So you had well over a year, year and a half to play around with everything. Yep, I had. And it'll probably be around the same, or at the very least, the cargo refactor. Had it every ship too. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, Darren, you haven't, you haven't played it? You should. Oh, man. Okay, so Darren, I need you to I need you to play Tachyon for me. For one character and one character only, and that is Baron Hajad, whose voice actor absolutely poured his heart and soul into the delivery of the plans. Oh, that was stupid. I shouldn't have like, went there because I, don't go I gotta uh, log off. Artists, but like, you know, I know them, or I know, I know his stuff. Uh, 10K. I'm actually on, a, on an M.2 right now. Like I had it on an SSD, and I, had, I didn't really notice a performance difference between the two. Yeah, Colin, you've got you've got a while before the next reset. I think you'll be all right. At the very earliest, I would say 318. And Chimpasta, usually, um, sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. It kind of depends. Uh, now, if you're like on an exploit and you got yourself millions and millions and millions of credits, you know, not illegally, but, you know, exploitively, then, then yeah, usually they'll go ahead and just wipe you. They'll wipe you like a nursing home resident. Oh, nice little crater over there. You know, it's always super fun parking at Humboldt. by the rock. Gonna try to log off your There's screenshot. Degrees. There we go. Engines yeah, you're already in the ladder, so I gotta oh, go yeah, up here dude. and come back down. I mean, that's, that's the fun part right there. This character needs to log off first anyway. Oh, the, the jet. oh, black sheep, I'm sorry. We'll keep it down. We'll level oh, did I... Yeah. Maybe if I did that. Yeah, a lot of the uh Go ahead and get the elevator anyway. FPS can be server specific. Alright. The more you have in the server, the more the FPS tends to do. And uh Jerry, we're actually in the in the C two. Which I mean is kind of a okay, kind of a mega lancer. Uh you know, Dancy, it kinda depends. Um if you're after if you're after Quantini, a lot of people say Leary is really good. I like to go to Hero 3 or the Aaron Halo belt. But it really just depends on what you're after. Hey, but I just did that. Get out. Alright. Uh, sorry, I think God, hangers are coming in 317. Alright. Yeah. But I'm pretty sure those are Log out. 
You know, Nikki, I, origin ships are nice, but they don't really have cargo capacity. They're actually very under-cargoed for, for what they are. Ugh, yep, everything's back to... I don't want to say Alright, that's going to do it. To. Been fun playing, listening to radio. Try to get this set up to be a little more uh, organized. Uh, Try to time my gameplay with like two or three... Uh, if it matters, it's plugged directly Two or three little cast. All right, that is it for me. Boards. Hopefully somebody comes by and watches this to get some, a, something, a kick out of it. That is all.